Hi everyone, in this video, I wanna to speak to more of the pre-nursing students out there or some of the people who are considering becoming a registered nurse in 2021. A lot of what has been going on in the past year has affected many people's perception of being a registered nurse. And rightfully so, things have not been perfect. However, in this video, I will explain to you guys whether or not I think being a registered nurse in 2021 or 2022 is worth it or not. In this channel, I talk about all aspects of nursing. If you want to learn more about nursing, consider subscribing as I upload a new video every week. Also, be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you found it useful as it helps others see the video as well. Before I weigh in on whether I think being a registered nurse is worth it or not, let's talk about some general information that is good to know about how to become a nurse. Being a registered nurse requires four years of undergraduate studies. There are two-year nursing programs and four-year ones, but even the two-year nursing programs require at least two years of undergraduate uh, studies in order for you to even be able to apply. After completion, you get a Bachelor's of Science in Nursing and have to write the NCLEX exam in order for you to be able to fully be qualified as an RN. Now, you can still work as an RN for the year after completion, but you have a temporary license that may expire depending on the province or state you live in. With that being said, after you've completely finished all of this and you've obtained your license, you're able to work in almost any setting. However, people work in the hospital first. Now, let's talk about some of the pros and cons about being a registered nurse. Some of the pros of being a registered nurse is when you graduate, you can typically find a job quite easily as nurses are needed everywhere. This is a great aspect of the job as you do not need to wait for months to find a job. You can pretty much be guaranteed a job immediately when you graduate and in some instances are even offered a job before. Another advantage of choosing nursing for your bachelors is that you will make above the average salary in everywhere you live. If you look at the province or state you live in, the income you will be making is going to be typically above the average. This is because nurses are considered being an essential job that society needs. Imagine being in a hospital without any nurses. It just would not function. Therefore, as a society, we need nurses and as a result, their salaries are going to reflect that. The other advantage is the flexibility of the career. You can further your education very easily and you can work in almost every setting. I talk about this a lot in my other videos and it is the, one of the main reasons why I chose this profession. Okay, now let's talk about some of the cons of choosing nursing. The job is difficult from an emotional, physical, and mental perspective. Here's how. Emotionally, you're dealing with patients' lives, and there's the circumstances which they're there for may be very difficult for you to be able to cope with that. For instance, tragic cases of patients who are very young and have terminally ill conditions which you have to provide care for. Situations like these are so incredibly common and after a while seeing these types of cases can cause emotional distress. Just ask any nurse you know and they will have a sad situation that they have either been a part of or experienced. This job is also physically challenging, turning patients, boosting them, and having to do many tasks throughout the day can be very, very physically demanding. You also have to deal with a lot of the unknown. For instance, a patient can be physically aggressive due to their state of mind that they are in, and you have to always expect that this is a possibility. Lastly, the job is mentally very distressing from dealing with 12 hour work days and nights to patients abusing you. You can be incredibly frustrated at the end of your day and over time this can build up and make you burn out. The other con of nursing is that healthcare is slow to improve. Procedures, policies, and the way things are run within a healthcare system take an incredible amount of time to change. 
This can be very distressing as there, as there are inherent flaws in every healthcare system, which can create a situation where you repeatedly see the same thing occurring again and after again. Now, here are my thoughts. I believe that being a nurse is absolutely worth it in 2021 or 2022. The job market is huge and there are so many opportunities for nurses to take advantage of. If a work condition is poor, you can change and work elsewhere very easily. Being a nurse is needed everywhere in the world, which makes you um, able to work anywhere you want. If you want to travel a lot, nursing is a great career for you. And al although the job itself is quite difficult, being able to be the person the patient trusts and provide healing is one of the greatest feelings you can get. As a result, I feel that being a nurse in 2021 or 20 in 2021 so far has been totally worth it. And I'm looking forward to practicing more in 2022. Thank you so much for watching and let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are.